many days left and I need God to turn off the water. The Freedom Rock is still transforming for this Memorial Day weekend. For 17 years in a row, Bubba Sorensen has painted the Freedom Rock in Medlow to thank veterans for their service. This Memorial Day, he had the opportunity to thank a group of them in person. You wouldn't know it by looking, but up until last year, these old buddies hadn't seen each other in decades. One day out of the blue, he called me in September and he says, what are you doing this weekend? And Nothing if you're coming down, you know. They're from all over the country. Minnesota, Ohio, Vermont. And today, it's Dennis's turn to show off his home in Iowa. We all met in, uh, in Vietnam and uh, second, we was in second CAG together, Marine Corps. Yesterday we were in Vietnam, today we're getting together. It's like there was no time lost. And but 43 years had passed. The Freedom Rock is their first stop this Memorial Day weekend. This rock being here is, is baffling. It's just, it, it's almost like it's in the middle of nowhere, but it's, it sure, has, for me, holds a real important statement. One of the big reasons I do this is because I chose not to serve. And uh, because of that, I just want those who have served to know how much I appreciate it. Well, you being such a great artist, boy, I know. Thanks. Each May, Bubba paints new scenes on this 90 ton boulder the Gadsden flag, four chaplains, but this helicopter. This is one constant. I'll paint around everything else, you know, everything else goes white. Nearly 80 Vietnam veterans' ashes are mixed in with this paint. They'll be here forever. So it's only appropriate these brothers meet again here, where some of their others will always rest. I think it's a hell of a tribute. Stephanie Nolte, KCCI 8 News, I was news leader. And if you would like to see the Freedom Rock in person, it's located just off Interstate 80, south of the Greenfield exit on Highway 25.